we are very cognizant, I think, in Oakland that that they are having a hard time raising money and and getting all this financing together. And partly, uh, what we've been seeing a lot in Oakland is them seeming to be very open to a lot of different ways to try and somehow get this two hundred million dollars uh, in TV money by staying in Oakland uh, from 2025 to 2027 because because they desperately need money. And that two hundred million dollars, you know, I, I think they in a lot of ways, they would love to go somewhere else, but they just desperately need that money. And they're afraid, I think, that the, the state and Alameda County are going to tell them to get lost. Um, what have you been hearing in Nevada? You know, your ear to the ground. I don't know. I don't know if people people talk to you that much knowing that you're the opposition of this whole thing. But like, you know, what have you been hearing about his ability to finance this thing? So, I mean, what we know, uh, like, we don't have inside sources on that. I mean, yeah. you know, look, let's be honest. Um, I would love to kill the stadium deal uh, in Las Vegas and, and keep those public monies in public services, including public schools, which is what my day job uh, is about, fighting for, you know, more resources, you know, for schools and for kids uh, and educators in Nevada. Um I'd love to kill that thing with, uh, you know, a referendum that goes to the ballot and the voters reject it or or our litigation that, you know, goes you know, uh, in, in, to a judge who, who, who rules that it's unconstitutional. I would love to score the win. Right. Like you always wanted to win the game. Right. With a walk off. <laughs> um, uh, that would be that would be fantastic. Um, but if they balk a, a run in. And, and that's that's sort of how we win this. Um, a win's a win, right? Uh, you yeah. know, win, win and move on. Um, and so part of our thinking um, is that just gumming up the works, creating enough uncertainty to make it to make it hard for John Fisher to uh, find financing um, and, and close deals. And, and I'll tell you. Um, it got a lot of play, uh, probably here and, and you know, uh, on the Internet uh, when Fisher came uh, to the Cham Las Vegas Chamber of Commerce event mm -hmm. and had that little kind of softball session. And then at the end of it, the host uh, had to get up and there was like no no reaction, no applause. And, uh, you know, she wanted to know if, if uh, Las Vegas was alive out there. Um, and, you know, I think. Most of the credit. Um, goes to A's fans for uh, organizing, taking this movement nationwide and exposing John Fisher for, for being a bad person, uh, possibly an even worse, you know, businessman. Um, and then, you know, we get to go and, and create political uncertainty, legal and political uncertainty around whether or not this $380 million is actually going to happen. And then you have, you know, I think a lot of uh, what Alex, we were talking about earlier around baseball, maybe not working um, really well in Las Vegas. Um, you know, the NFL and the Raiders work, not because there's, you know, a huge groundswell of support for the Raiders in Las Vegas. It's because, you know, NFL teams travel and uh, Legion Stadium is, uh, you know, at least half full of opposing fans. Uh, every game that they play there, that's not going to be the reality on, you know, uh, you know, a, a Tuesday afternoon set or uh, something like that in, in Las Vegas with all of those games and all of those weekday games. That's that's not the business model. I don't think works as well. So you have these confluence of factors, I think, that makes it very difficult uh, for Fisher. Um, you know, he out of the gate, um, you know, the, the big, you know, you know, lending institutions, um, you know, the B of A's and the Wells's and, you know, Chase's, they weren't even being discussed as, you know, possible financing. Uh, right. So right to Goldman Sachs. So right to Goldman gonna Sachs. Offer who's who's going to do a, kind lot, of a lot higher interest. Yeah. You know, uh, you know, who are, who are, who are, you know, who are more willing to, to take on the higher risk projects and, 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 and charge more. Um, but we don't even hear much about Goldman Sachs uh, anymore. 
Um, and so Fisher's out at the Las Vegas uh, Chamber event, and he even says in the softball interview um, that he'd love to get support from Las Vegas. And he walked it back. He, he goes back um, and forth. He doesn't even know what he wants. I don't think. It so I mean, I think he, I think he did want to get support from Las Vegas, but I don't think it was forthcoming. Yeah. Um, and yeah. so you know, look at a certain point, John Fisher, or let's be honest, John Fisher's siblings are going to have to decide if they want to underwrite this deal or not. Um, you know, I, I actually believe that if the broader Fisher family uh, wanted to do it and was driven to do it, that they could uh, probably yeah. put it together to do it. I'm not, I don't know the dynamics of the Fisher family. I, you know, I knew the old man a little bit and kind of battled, had my battles with him. Um, but who knows what the dynamics are in the Fisher's family um, until what, like a, a week ago or so, um, you know, they had been saying that they were going to get some sort of, you know, equity uh, for that remaining tranche of money that they needed. Um, I think, you know, was it Caval a week ago that said, you know, the family was going to step in if need be, we'll see. Right. Uh, yeah. And if not, maybe this thing dies because, they couldn't put together the financing, no financing, no development agreement. And then guess what? If you don't have a development agreement uh, and the related other agreements, and then, you know, the order to Clark County to issue the bonds, um, you're not going to see a cent of that $2 million uh, from the community benefits agreement because the community benefits agreement only gets uh, triggered as effective when Clark County sells bonds.